Griezmann taking up his position on the far post. This time Mbarba marks him. Header down and Griezmann scores! A bit of control on the game. And there's a chance now for Diego Costa, not scored yet in La Liga this season. He's unselfish. He plays it into Antoine Griezmann. He had the chance to get his first La Liga goal of the season. Instead, slipped it inside to his strike partner, Antoine Griezmann, who scores his second La Liga goal of the campaign. And like you say, Costa, very unselfish because I think many other strikers would have tried to hit the target, especially not having scored as many goals this season yet. But brilliant pass and 1 0 for Atletico Madrid. Could it be argued that it shows a lack of confidence from Diego Costa or is it just the right thing to do? It's a goal, it's the right thing to do. <laughs> uh, I don't know. It was a belter of a strike, but it's going to be Antoine Griezmann who's going to strike it and he is going to go for goal. Griezmann, oh! My goodness me! What a strike! from Antoine Griezmann, too far out, not a chance, it's an absolute stunner from the Frenchman. In La Liga, Leganes nil, Atletico won. Well, it's the man that caused controversy earlier in the season by suggesting that he should be, as the phrase went, sitting at the same table as Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi, and as he lined up that free kick, might have even gone through his mind. If this was Ronaldo or Messi, they'd definitely go for goal here. Lovely ball from Vitolo through to Griezmann. Griezmann can finish it here. He's only got the goalkeeper to beat. And in the end, LaGuardia does enough. Not quite enough, because Griezmann follows in the rebound. And Griezmann up into the top corner of the net. And Atletico de Madrid do lead by two goals to nil. Delight in the upper echelons of the Jose Soria. A really, really well struck penalty. Stunning, even if Jordi Massive had gone the right way, I doubt he'd have got anywhere near that. Right up into the top corner, calm as you like, from the Atletico number seven. And it is Real Valladolid nil, Atletico two. Massive organising as the two central defenders from Atletico come forward once more. Rodri with the shot and it hit his own man there. Savage comes out, Griezmann will shoot and Griezmann scores. And Atletico are back in front. Rodri just rolled it into his path. And it's three for Atletico, two for Griezmann. Right from Griezmann. It was actually Savage that played it into his path. Rodri with that shot that hit Savage. Stumble clearance by Plano. What a finish that is. A cross massive, a really instinctive effort. Scuffed clearance, but no doubt what he wanted to do with that Griezmann as soon as it came towards him. 11 metres out, there you can see where he put his last penalty in the Liga Santa there, right up and into that top corner. And he puts it into the same spot, right up into the top corner of the net. And Atletico de Madrid have made Espanyol pay for those missed opportunities in the first half. And it is Los Colchoneros who lead here in the 56th minute of the game. Might be cocky, you know. Whistle goes. It's Griezmann. Oh, what magic from Antoine Griezmann. That's unstoppable. That is world-class football from Antoine Griezmann. That is absolutely perfect skill from Ant Antoine Griezmann. But well, here's their star man. He's dragged them out on equaliser that they thoroughly don't deserve. And will it be the last six goals for Atletico scored by the Frenchman? Absolutely it will. There's no stopping that penalty as he rifles it into the top corner. 21 years of age and wearing the number 21. And Atletico with a debutant waiting to come on on the sidelines. We've already seen him. Lining up as Atletico hit the crossbar, and it is in the net, and it is 3-0. That could well be game, set and match for Los Colchoneros. See the move again here. Lucas with the cross, it was Griezmann's header down. 
I've got to say, that's a very good finish again. It puts it down into the ground to take it away from the Wesker defenders here. There's Koke. It is Wesker near. Partey. I got away from him. Flicks it inside to Griezmann. What a finish from Antoine Griezmann. Top class goal from the Frenchman. No wonder he celebrates effusively. That was an absolute first-class finish from Griezmann. He doesn't think twice. Partey collects it here. That looked like a heavy touch. He looked as though he was preparing for a shot. Instead, slipped the ball just wide. As you said, they've been attacking. Now they really have to... Oh, they have to come out. It's, it's, uh, this is the game we want. Griezmann goes for the curling shot, and it comes back off the post. So, so close to an equaliser. Casemiro, they're enjoying themselves out there, the players in the white shirts. Vinicius, the first touch was heavy. He's dispossessed by Correa, through the middle to Griezmann. Griezmann onside. Griezmann! 1-1! Antoine Griezmann. It's offside. The flag is up for offside. The referee will have to be speaking too far. Well, it's celebrate us, interrupt us once again. The Wanda Metropolitano absolutely desperate to celebrate this one. Taking his time, Estrada Fernandez, as he listens to the advice of his colleagues in Las Rozas. I think it was Ramos there that if, he, if anyone if it's, was playing... Uh, if it's on, it's on yeah. I think it was a push. It's Rodrigo now, out to Felipe Luis. Can he get the cross in? He can. Aim towards Morata, bar only half clears, it drops to Griezmann in the area and they've scored! Atletico Madrid take the lead, and who else but Anton Griezmann, he loves playing against Rio Vallecano, eight goals in 14 matches against them, he's made it nine in 15. Aqui Atletico de Madrid, it's almost the first shoot, and it's maybe an offside on Alfa Morata, let's see if the bars attacks, because we see in the first cross that Morata was maybe offside. And, uh... It's good to see them performing like this. This is the kind of passes we want to see. Griezmann with a chance to make it four as he tries to lift it over Pacheco and it comes back off the post. And he so nearly did. From Thomas, one touch from Griezmann is on the move again. Gets, a, I think, gets a bit of luck there. Yeah. Comes off the defender. And that goes down as a half chance, perhaps. Now the break is on at the other end. Antoine Griezmann through the centre, one on one with Gorka Irazos, and he clips it up and over. And that is game, set, and match. So, so comfortable for the striker. Antoine Griezmann makes it 2 0. And the points go to Atletico de Madrid here, Pete. And he's just a level above everything else, isn't he? Everything else that they've got, and everything else that most teams have got. And. Uh, they managed to keep him last summer. This summer they need to make sure they build a team around him. Brilliant finish and um, seven points. All eyes on the Ceramica Stadium and I'm sure that uh, having beaten the team that play in yellow, they'll now be backing the team that play in yellow to, to do, a, do them a favour against Barcelona. Just a slight shimmy to force Eizos into making a decision. The pair of them are over it once again. Once again there's a Real barrier in front, there's at least five players in the wall, then two extras for Celtics. Griezmann up and over the wall, it's a stunning opening goal. Past the wall, past the goalkeeper and into the top corner of the net. And we have the breakthrough here in the 42nd minute of the game. It's Atletico 1, that's Celta de Vigo 0. It's like just a penalty for him. Look the way he should he finding the the way to beat uh, Ruben Blanco, almost unstoppable. Uh, it worked Correa and Felipe Luis in that, in that position. He, they opened that door, and Antoine Griezmann, Griezmann is scoring an incredible goal. Atletico Madrid has been looking. He went as a number 10, and he played as a right back at some part uh, against Eibar, so he really is a versatile midfielder. Here's Griezmann, Morata, back out to Lamar. Lamar with the cross, Griezmann with the header, and Atletico Madrid are back in front. Just three minutes into the second half, it was all so easy. The cross dinked to the back post, and Antoine Griezmann, well, that little holiday has done him the world of good because he's in the goals, and Atletico Madrid are back into the lead.